So this is actually the third year that I'm coming to Design Miami. It's an immense pleasure to be here and just to be in this kind of platform of uh, exhibition and design. To me personally, it's actually really interesting to see that the interactive design and interactive art element is kind of expanding. There's more people here um, with very interesting pieces. And uh, just overall, I just feel it's uh, the, the general public and the general interest we've seen so far has just made it just, uh, just a fantastic place to be. So my background is actually in architecture, and I think that's where, where my whole interest in design started. To me, the, the most important thing of any piece is that moment of engagement. It's when the observer realizes that they're actually becoming an active participant in what they're looking at. So for all the pieces that I, I started with, which tend to be very digital, um, very electronic pieces, I feel I've almost, it was almost the wrong way around, but now I've started going back to analog. Um, and that's not to say I'm not doing digital, no, that's, it's, I'm, I'm gonna keep on working these video pieces, but when you look at the shimmer piece, it's, it's, it's got this kind of moment where it, the, the colors change as you move around it. It's incredibly pure and saturated color, and yet it's, there's no digital element of control within that interactive color shift. One of my favorite pieces is Flutter. My sole goal was actually to capture the flight of a butterfly and then display it in a way where that incredible flight found in nature has been slowed down, romanticized and reinterpreted and then is being interactively controlled by the viewer as they become, as they walk past it or they interact with it. I'm continuing on the journey that I started with the flutter piece, except this time I'm turning my attention to birds and I've selected 20 of the, what to me are the most fantastic birds. They're portrayed almost as if they were in a photographer's studio against a grey backdrop, sitting there waiting for the photograph to be taken. To answer the question about what's coming up next, there's going to be a lot of work in carbon fibre and ever increasingly large structures where design, technology, art and experience come together to create just a single object, a piece, something that can hang on a wall, something you can walk through. But it's when all the pieces come together to create just one experience.